Hello, welcome back Farming Simulator Club members. We got some new mods in today, so I'm going to show them off. I'm also going to tell you guys what mods are in testing. Right now we have the Valley of the Old Farm in testing, the Fiat 120C, Growly, a Chieftain Triaxle Low Loader, Bell's Auto Load Pack, IT Runner Pack, and Hoodat Hooter Ranch. And also make sure if you guys like this video, you guys pound the like button, and if you haven't subscribed, make sure you guys subscribe. Okay, here we go. Okay, we have quite a few mods and a lot of mad map updates. Okay, first map update we have is for Hagenstead. Uh, this just adds sugarcane to cell point, adds sugarcane to farm silo. Okay, then we have another one from Mustang Valley Ranch. Uh, just adds sugarcane. And Golden Days of Farming, add sugarcane. And Farming Legend, added sugarcane. Okay, so... We got a lot more choices of maps about sugarcane now. Okay, we have the Bogan Animal Trailer. This is by CD Models, 26 foot twin axle livestock trailer manufactured by Brogan Engineering in County Carlow, Ireland. Comes with aluminum sides and checkered floor. Comes with galvanist slurry tank and loading ramp. Price is 24,500 euros. Maintenance is 15 euros a day. Uh, there's new textures, color changes, multiple choice of wheels, room color selection, animated hoses. New animated gates and optional number plates. Okay, got that one going. Then we have, a, this is going to be an update for this one. The Kinnon Mech Fiber 340 Feeder Wagon. Uh, updated decals for new models. Uh, optional number plates. New wheels, tires, and animated hoses. Okay, then we have the Euro Tunnel Pack. This is by DD Mod Passion. Euro Tunnel Pack contains the following tunnel. Single arc with this wides 65 a5 93 10 4 and 12 0 meters reinforced arc it's coming soon straight leg l coming soon straight leg m it's coming soon straight leg xl multiple it's coming soon and there's the languages right there uh, features you can find the triggers by activating the help icons uh, the main structure main structure can be extended either sides of 2 4 4 8 7 2 or 9 6 meters for every arc you can choice a pallet position you can turn on or off every single light. Okay, there's that one. Then we have wooden gates by Mappers Paradise. Uh, wooden gates to place around the maps. Price is $799. I mean, it's only one euro a day. Okay, we have trees pack. Pack of trees that can be cut and used for logging. This is by Dorset. That downloading. Homemade Hungarian Combinator. This is by Tarzi007 and Ornabai. Homemade Hungarian Combinator. Price is 5,000 euros. Working with 15 kilometers per day. Required power is 35 horsepower. Working with 3 meters. And maintenance is 5 euros a day. Okay. Then we have the Heron 16 ton H1 silage trailer. This is by CD Models. Which CD Models probably will be my next modern spotlight one. Okay, I'm not going to read all this. I'm just going to uh, tell you what it is. The H1 16-ton trailer is designed to be robust and reliable for moving a variety of materials. Uh, price is €18,650 and maintenance is €35 Euros a day. Okay, then we have the 500 kilogram weight and this is by Maxter. Uh, small weight for front load work. Get that installed. And then we have Scarecrow. This is by Stefan1997. This is just a placeable Scarecrow. Okay, well, now I'll be showing these got, uh, showing these off in a map. Thank you, guys. Hello, welcome back. Okay, here we are. Here's the new mods. I'm going to show you guys them off. Okay, this is the uh, Brogan, the animal trailer right here. I like the colors on it. A lot bigger. Long vehicle. It's got plates on it. Okay, here's the cultivator with the pallet on it. Okay, and here's the heron. The 16 fast fast ton. It's pretty nice. Nice stickers on it. This is the smaller version of it right here. Heron. Danger. Keep clear of unpropped body. Warning. Crush zone. Keep clear. 
Okay. And here's the weight right here. The 500 kilogram weight. Okay, let's see if there's any special options with these trailers. Okay, this ain't a new mod right here. This is just, uh, this is the Volta right here. Okay, let's attach this. Okay, as you can see, it's got like a metal, metal thing in the back. Whoa. It's got a beacon right there. Lot, the sides light up. Okay, let's see, unfold livestock trailer, let's see what this does. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, the gate's actually open, wow. Uh, I think that's it with this, and then of course closing it. It's even got that like the metal creaking sound. Okay, well, I like that. Okay. Let's see if there's anything special with these things. Okay, map size. It looks like there's no beacons on them. Sides do not light up. Let's see. Beacon. Radio cruise control. Let's check how it unloads. Okay, it does lift up. So I'll also make sure that you have enough clearance to unload and everything. Okay. So this goes down. I'm not going to show the cultivator and the weight really because there's not really much of a difference with those. Okay, let's check out this one. Like no lads in the back, and this should just yeah lift up. Yep. Okay. Okay. Where well, there's those four mods. Okay. Now we're gonna start looking at the placeables. The placeables are right over here. Okay. First we have the tree pack right here. They have like they have small, medium, large. They have some dead ones. This is right here. I think this is a dead pine. And then we have big one right here. A pine right here, and I believe this one's a perch. I'll show all everything off in the shop and how many slots it takes up and all that and the price. Okay, then we have the wooden gates right here. Okay, this is one of the gates. Let's see how that opens. Okay, it looks like it's yeah slides. That's pretty cool. Let's close that one. Okay, this is like our normal gates we usually use. These are automatic gates. You just press it once and they open. Okay, this one should slide to the right. Yep. And this one should slide to the left. Yep. Okay, and this one, I believe, is a small one. Yeah. Okay. Well, there's the gates right there. Okay, next we're looking at is the Euro Tunnel Pack. Okay, this is the smallest one. So far, it's a lot smaller. I just made it big because I was testing it out. Okay, but when you get in here, the first thing you'll see is just like this, basically, with the light off. Basically, uh, hot. I can see there's some clipping of the grass in there, though. Okay, basically, when you do it, you basically just hold down, hold down your L1, or you know the opposite of the Xbox one, and just push L, and then there they go. Okay, got lights right here, then extending, then pallets, more lights, and put pallets if you hold down the R1 button. So you turn on light. And all you do is just get into the light part, you don't have to press, you just have to push the uh, O or B button. And then the light comes on. Now say you want to extend it. Okay, you like just go out here. I can get it to go on. Okay, right there. Hold the R1 button and then increase length. And there we go. It stutters for a second, but then that's it. See, 
Now it's a lot bigger. And see all the pallets out there? And now let's say we want to put a pallet on here. Okay, you just go to the pallet part and you hold down the R1 button and you press the X button. And then there they go. The thing I'm checking out is to see if we can actually pick up those pallets. I don't think we can, but it's worth the test. I don't know if I can even get in there. Yeah, I don't think you can even get in there. Okay, looks like it's just a palace to place they put stuff on or whatever. Okay. Okay, well this is the Euro Tunnel Pack. Where is it at? There it is. Okay. You reset link to 9.6. See, it goes back to smaller again. See, it stutters for a second. Okay. Recent lathe. See, and this is how small it was when you first start out. Okay, and there's the bigger one right here. Okay, let's. I'm gonna erase everything, and then I'm gonna show you guys the slots and everything. Okay, let's just sell everything. And if you guys are wondering what map this is, this is Sinovka. Yeah, see Birch Dead, Pine Giant. Okay. Okay, first thing we're gonna look at is let's look at the tippers. This is the Heron pack right here. Comes with Heron sixteen ton, it's eighteen thousand six hundred and fifty. It takes up uh, nine slots. Uh it's thirty five uh dollars a day. Uh, you got standard road, flotation road, twin implement, and twin radial. And then rim color, you got white, gray, or black. We got without front panel, add front panel, without air brakes, add air brakes, add air brakes, and front panel. And I believe this one is the same one, except for it's just different color. Okay, then we got the Heron 16 ton trailer. This one holds 16,500. This is $25 a day, and this is 10 slots. And standard, flotation, twin implements, twin radial. And then you just got white and gray for the rim color. And then we have without front panel, add front panel, without air brakes, and add air brakes, add air brakes and front panel. Okay, this is the Heron. Okay, then next we have is the, the animal trailer. Let's go find the animal trailer. Animals. Here's the broken 28 foot animal trailer. It's only 24,500. It's $15 a day. And it looks like it only takes up one slot, which that might be just a mess up right there. Hopefully it takes up one slot. Uh, but main color we have, uh, we have a lot of colors you can choose from. We have standard road, flotation road, twin implements, rim color, lots of rim color choices. We have uh, plates, no rag plate. Irish, UK, or German, or no reg. Okay, then we have the cultivator. The cultivator is 5,000. It is five slots, three meters. Uh, you need 35 horsepower. It's $20 a day, and operating speed is nine miles an hour. And there's no options on that one. Okay, what do we have next? I believe next is going to be probably the placeables. Oh, wait, we have the weight next. Okay, let's go to weights. Okay, there's the 500 kilogram weight. It's only 400. Uh, zero maintenance a day, and it takes up only two slots. So that's, that's pretty good. Okay, now we're going to go to the placeables. Okay, this is the Euro Tunnel Pack. The single arc 6.65 six meter is 
five slots and it's six dollars a day it's eight thousand then the single arc a5 meter meter is eleven thousand dollars takes up five slots eight dollars a day so you see the price is going a little bit up and the single arc 93 is nine dollars a day five slots see this is it says for basically uh bales basically so whenever i figure out how to use them more i might make a video for for you guys Okay, and then this is ten dollars a day, five slots, thirteen thousand. Uh, single R twelve is fifteen thousand, twelve dollars a day, five slots. So no matter what, it's gonna take five slots for these ones. Okay, let's see if we can find the other ones. Okay, those are not mods. Um, where are you guys? Okay, here's the trees right here. We got birch small is 100. They take up one slot, zero. I believe none of these trees take up any money a day, I believe. Then medium takes up two slots. Uh, large takes up two slots. Birch large is 1,500. It takes up only one slot. Uh, birch dead, uh, 500, two slots. Birch, uh, pine small. One slot, fifty dollars. Pine medium, one fifty, two slots. Pine large, four fifty, two slots. Pine extra large, two slots, one thousand five hundred. Pine giant, one thousand nine hundred, two slots. Pine dead, seventeen hundred, two slots. Popular, twenty five hundred, two slots. Spruce small, fifty. Spruce medium, one hundred. Spruce large, one fifty. Spruce giant. 2100 two slots and that's that okay i think the last one is the gates those are not the gates okay there's the gates right here uh double wide siding gate is 7.99 it's one dollar a day uh slots one i believe every one of these are just one slot yeah they are and i believe each one is 7.99 Yep, each one's $7.99 and $1 a day. Okay, well, thank you guys for watching. Make sure if you guys like this video, you guys pound that like button. And if you haven't subscribed, make sure you guys subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.